Emotional day here for Chelsea. You can see that on the face of uh, Pini Lajada, who walks out in the blue of Chelsea here for the last time. Well, having made seven changes for the midweek win at West Ham, Chelsea revert to the side that beat Manchester United in last weekend's cup final. Uh, with a couple of alterations, Sophie Ingle and Penelope Hara both started and scored against the Hammers. Let's take the knee and a reminder to everyone here and everyone watching worldwide, the battle against racism from football always. Off we go, Arsenal in the red and white, kicking from left to right against the Chelsea side who've won their last 14 home matches in the WSL. Just Carter only much as substitutes. He's right and an early feed of the ball for Manuela Zinsberger. But it was interesting the way that Chelsea got behind Arsenal. Very easy. Now Kerr, harder. Flag stayed down momentarily. It was then raised. Zinsberger dealt with it. Arriving now, Brighton. Big deflection. What is she? That's over the top for Chelsea, looking for Harder, will come to Wrighton, good challenge on her by football club. Ingle, Wrighton, oh lovely ball, Kerr, tickles it away, offside. <laughs> 27 goals she has in 36 games this season, a oh, oh, little bit of an error there from Anne Katrinberger, really called in possession, and the pressure from... Plaxton, a FA Cup defeat at Chelsea, and Chelsea looking for revenge for their League Cup final defeat. And uh, Ford here has picked the pocket of Perisic, and an opportunity for Plaxtenius in the box tonight. Good goalkeeping. Lauren James lengthens a strike, brings in Kerr. Australian disappointed with held up well by Plaxtenius. Here's cool. Asking too much there. Was back in there defending. Away by Captain Ford. Bit of a slip from Perise, but the ball comes to the far post and right and stabs Chelsea ahead. <laughs> Chelsea closing in on the title. There was a little bit of fortune about the ball. I think. She slipped as she played it across, but it came through to right and who planted her. The freedom of a bat three, and here's Harden out. And then it goes to Kurt. This could be game over. No flag is raised, but they're going to get one of these right. If you're playing a back three and the opposition put... Couldn't quite come right for Manham. It did in the end, and it's parried away at the second time of asking by Anne Katrinberg, who didn't get the first save right. Arsenal have had a couple of moments now, the one from Blackstanius and that one from Marnham. Got the first save wrong. Could have dropped into Rome net. Here's Kerr at the other end now. Possibly went to the wrong side of Zinsberg, who stuck out the leg. Marnham wants a go at it. Better save that time. That's poor by Chelsea, and that might have been going in. Worthy of an effort anyway by Victoria Pullova. And Perisay just, uh, Milda just dropped back to make sure it wasn't going in. Now harder, goalkeeper needed the call for it. It's a dangerous ball in. In the end, it's about it. But Arsenal let that ball go all the way through, and Ingles won it back. She's been imperious in this first half and was fouled there. Person would have taken it the other way, right and into the box, looking for Kerr, free head of the back post, and Ericsson on her final game in a Chelsea shirt on this ground gets the second goal of the day. Chelsea are getting closer and closer. Really poor defending by in this first half. Absolutely lovely ball. Kerr. She had to Pinilla Harder in the middle available.
Arsenal we're seeing here now. Catholic across the far side of the penalty area, headed back in. Ball was arriving. Much better from the Gunners. Penilla Harder, Engel arriving. Oh, did beautifully. Stopped for the near post by Sinsberger. Lovely spin by Penilla Harder. Put the game to bed. And they might get one harder off the line. Might have been creeping wide anyway. McCabe got it off the line. Perisic. And she's there again. Sam Kerr. Engel. Nearly touched him. They're given a chasing in that first half. Oh, sliced by Eric. Nearly came through to Catelyn Ford. And away by Perisic in the end, I think. Arsenal going close to get into the Champions League reckoning. In comes that cross, good punch away from Berger. McCabe with a tight control. Did that hit a hat? Hit Sophie Ingle. Oh, on the hat. Can she unsettle the champions elect? No, she can't. That's a dreadful spot kick. Really poor. Back Catley out wide. Oh, the cross it was dangerous by Freedom Honor to go at it. There's the little dummy right at looks for Kerr. Almost a set, almost. It was partially won only by BT. Drives straight at the goalkeeper. Catley. Four back to the left. She's causing problems here for Perisek. Opened a body, went to bend it. Too near the goalkeeper. Arsenal on different sides in the Olympic final. It's an opportunity now, perhaps that's offside against Taylor. Wouldn't have counted. Better angle here to drive it in. And the goalkeeper saw it late, that made it a decent parry. It comes to the ball. Oh, this time the goalkeeper's missed it. Comes out. And a good challenge by Engel. That's a goalkeeper. That's a fantastic challenge. On Pelova. She's been outstanding, Sophie Engel. From close range, Eriksen headed it down. Wrighton. All oh, right, was going to get there, you know. And Raffaella was on hand to clear it up. Fleming around the corner, looks for the return from right. And Fleming tried to square it for Kerr, and it very nearly went in off Wilbur Moy, which would have been cruel. They were trying to set it up there for... That's it. It's over to Manchester United. Now they'll have to respond if they drop points against Manchester City. The title will be Emma Hayes and Chelsea's tonight.